So remember, when you come to these jam nights, these musicians do so much. Look at Piers. He has to put all that drum kit in his car, take it home. He brings it here. He works so hard behind the scenes. And well done to Piers and everyone. Yes. <laughs> I've done that. And now I'm coming back to make my behind the scenes jam nights part two. I'm trying to show Janet how hard you, you, I can oh, interview no. you. Do you mind? Basically, because no. you're close to Graham and that. You feel me? No. I am. How, 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 how many hours before the jam night starts does Graham and the crew get there? I get here. Me and, me and Piers get here about 6, 6.30. So that's like two hours before it starts. And then how much longer are they here after it ends? Gone 12. So they put an extra three, four hours into the jam night than the actual jam night itself. Yeah, you won't be home. And the mighty bar, the bar crew, Naomi and Darren and the, the mighty Denise and what's that one called, Faye? Ray. 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 And they all work so hard behind the scenes too, didn't they? They, get it, they must get here earlier and stay here after. Yeah, they have to. It's part of the job. So next time you go to a jam night, think of the work that goes into them beforehand and after. Shine on. That's very true. Thank you, Graham. And 